says I'm live. I believe I'm live. Let me put a post on Instagram real quick. Boop. Live. Put that right up there. And let me get going with this. Live bulk bin dig on YouTube. Boom. Link in bio. What's up, everybody? We're going to be going through this bulk bin here. We got some good stuff to find. Put some music on. I'm curious to see how the noise suppression works on the bulk bin. I expect it to do good. A little music on. Put that there. Three people watching right now. Much appreciated. You guys are awesome. Let's go open up my chat here. Put that there. All right. Cool. All right, let's get at it. Let's see how this works. See what minifigures we can find. I think we'll find a good amount of minifigures in here. This bin was from 2020, so it's kind of a newer bin, right? Turn my monitoring off real quick. It's gonna throw me way off. Okay. All right, so let's crack this open. Cut this open. What's everybody doing tonight? I need more parts. I'm running out of parts. And I just, I don't want to place too many Brickling Twitters just because I know I have a lot of parts, right? So why spend more money if I don't have to? That's just my thing. Plus, we're going to make some money on this thing. Yeah, buddy. Let's see. Let's see how, let's see the monitoring real quick. Monitor and out. I guess the voice expression works pretty good. I didn't hear the tape. Let me see if I can hear the, the bulk shifting around. No, I didn't. Oh, this is going to be a pleasurable live stream, then. For your ears, at least. I'm out of business. Third off, we're going to have to find some Star Wars parts right away. So that is a good sign. We have... where'd it go? This Star Wars right here. Right? Right? Yeah, this stuff. Let's put the camera. I can't see the camera. There we go. Some sort of Star Wars ship. I think it's a newer one. Not sure. We'll put that off to a Star Wars bin there. Don't need the scissors right now. Parts that we got here. Oh, I need these right here, needed for the baseball stadium, so that's perfect. What was that? Oh, give me all this. More Star Wars parts, so whatever this set is, Star Wars, light bluish gray brick, light dark bluish gray brick, need that. Great. Good stand to make a money back on this bullpen and get a lot of really good fun. So I'm off tomorrow from work, so that's always a fun. i doing this for at least a few hours. For Star Wars, right here. Huh? Little snow speeder wing. Lots of friends. We like friends because they have really good parts. All this tan plate right here. This is mint. We got some glue on it. Some sort. We wash all that anyway. We wash all that anyway. I'm not too worried.
But yeah, these parts are great right here. 8 by 16 plates. Those are much needed. Um, very handy. Light bluish plate. We need all the light bluish gray plate I can get right now. This goes to uh, Fish Face. This is the leg of Fish Face right here. I found it like a bunch of times in bulk. I never seen it before. And I found it once, now I can't stop finding it, right? Arches. I don't know if I'm collecting arches enough yet. I don't know if I'm going to need them in the future, but like when you need them, you're going to need them, right? Quarter. 25 cents back on our investment right there. Hand plate perfect. Here's the first mini fig. Looks like a generic, generic city mini fig. I gotta figure out how to make the camera focus on figs. I'll rig that up momentarily. And productions. Everyone's least favorite tea fall is here. Nah, man, you're, you know you're good in my book. What's up, dude? How you doing? Some more of that Star Wars set. These are much needed right now for the baseball stadium. The uh, door, dark green door frames. I think that is a bunch of stuff. Could be random for him. I don't know. It's a pink Chima head. Gary Mullane, hello from Ireland. What's up, Gary? How you doing tonight? How are you doing tonight, Gary? Just gonna be going through the book then. See what figs we can find. Hearts we can find. A lot of light bluish gray, which is what I need for the baseball stadium, which is good. A Big Bang Theory sticker right here. Put that to the side. There was an Adidas sticker somewhere too. I believe Chief wants that Adidas sticker. I remember I sent the picture of this bulk bin. He said he wanted that sticker. What's up, Shiny Bricks? What's up, man? Thanks for stopping. Where'd that Adidas sticker go? There should be somewhere in there. Whatever. I'm doing good. I had the day off from work tomorrow, so that is a great start to my uh, weekend right now. Snowing. I don't have to work tomorrow. Mixed uh, Ninjago torso here, I think. Though. Another cool sticker though. It's the second sticker we found in here. Ah yes, a pink a sheet. I wonder if I can get how close I can get to this camera to focus. Hmm. Let's figure out something real quick. Figure it out a little bit actually. Let's see like some more fig parts right here. Generic City fig. Two face construction goon fig. And a snow trooper helmet. Snow trooper helmet is good. Star Wars Angry Birds. Dude, there's an, there was an Adidas sticker right on top. What did I do with it? more minifig parts 
Just gotta make it too close for it to focus. I think this camera would focus better, but it doesn't. A rock. Can't beat a rock in a ball pin. Chima, Chima. Musket. Some sort of ice palace parts. I don't see much I can use on it. Take that bar piece. That panel piece. The glass piece is right here. That USB cord to something. Guess who's turning 14 next Monday? Hmm. Let me get. Yeah, I'm still thinking. M Productions. M Productions. Is it M Productions? Am I right? Did that win? Oh, good. Friends Airplane. Throw that. Minecraft Fig. Deppy Shep Ricks. Ah. Uh, is it BR? Ah, uh, dude, if I was 14, what, did, what was I doing at 14? I can't even remember what I was doing at 14. I was in high school. 14 high school? It had to be high school, I think. Oh, Playmobil Fig. Right on. I have a bin full of those I have to put on eBay soon. It is you! Alright. 14, man. Congratulations. Making it another year around the sun. Howie's Creations, what's going on? It's going pretty well so far. Right off the surface, I don't see a lot of fake Lego, so that's always a great start to it. I need to separate my mini figs better. I'm putting them in the parts bin. Oh my god. Getting distracted already. I have a bin off to the side here. I have to put the mini figure parts in. It was an Adidas sticker on top, I swear. I don't know what I did with it. What's up, TJ52? What's up, man? They've been college treating so far. COVID semester. Another one of those. Hey, it didn't die yet, man. Keep on, keep on, right? Another day above ground. So I, I like to say. College has been all right. I, I tell you, man, I give you credit. I would not want to be. It'd be interesting. I'll tell you, I'll say that. Star Wars Royal N1 Starfighter Naboo Pilot Stand. Yeah, it's Kyle. It's going to get interesting. I can tell you that. There's some Star Wars mixed in here. We got some nice Tuffy pins right here. Great for Mills plates. We love that. I have enough Technic pins, though. Ooh, look at this one. It's got destroyed. Focus on the brick, not my hand. It's not gonna fit it. Stupid camera. Well, this got destroyed. Brutal. Another rock. Fake Oyo. Lego base, not Lego. An Oyo fig. Found any Ninjago? Yeah, this Ninjago set right here. I know you can ID it. What's that? The. Uh, I don't know, I forget. I found some mixed max mix match Ninjago torso so far. That's that I know it's that one Ninjago said. The Battle for Ninjago City. Is that the one we're talking about like a few a few bins ago when it has that super expensive fig in it that I didn't find? Where's my brick separator at? I always keep one in my pocket. Battle from the Jogger. It is Battle from the Jogger. That's what I thought it was. Remember the dark green and the red trim? I'm actually going to take all these parts because I don't have that much red tile. 
dark blue, some dark red, or regular red. Not dark red, that stuff breaks way too easily. You guys already know about that. Mike McDonough, what's up, man? That might have the Golden Master Fig. Golden Master Fig, gold way where? Glass panel piece. Nice base plate. Let's hope it's there. I hope it's there. Definitely a part heavy looking bin. I don't know what this is, but I want the, I want the, the bars off it. Not much really here. My God, just cracked this bulk bin open. We're gonna go through it. Oh, we found our first fake Lego. It's unbranded one by three in a military olive green and a one by six. Gonna crack this up, go through it, have some uh, have some fun, find some figs, get some parts for the baseball stadium. I can keep working on that. I really want to have that done for April first, but I don't know, man. That's, that's coming closer and closer every day. But we will see. We will see. This is an eBay buy. I saw some good deals for bulk. Lately. No, this is not eBay. Uh, this is a local pickup. A local, a local source around here. Nice construction beam. Flash head, or flash hair piece, Anakin Skywalker hair piece, uh, rebel head piece thingy. And here's some gold. Maybe we do have some gold and Ninjago stuff in there. Focus. Trouble. Trouble folks. I mean, there's a nice tan plate right here. Roll our sleeves up. metal mending plate I haven't bought much bulk on eBay to be honest with you only because I get it local if I couldn't get it local I probably would be buying off eBay to be honest with you Some golden Jago armor. That piece isn't seen much these days. A eh? sitting on Jago gold, literally. Parts I'm mainly looking for are at least two by light blue straight plate or brick. Um, those. That's what I need really to finish off the top row of the baseball stadium on one side and start the other side. Then uh, window frames, door frames, whatever those are. There's a fake, there's a whole fake build actually. What brand is this? M38. M38. Get out of here. The fakeness. Fakeness. Oh, a little heart, a little heart pool. Still, get out of here. Take this plate though. I like to find some Lego gray slopes for mountains cheap. Yeah, no, yeah. I, I keep all the dark bluish gray and light bluish gray slopes as well. And they actually, they kind of, they bad up pretty quick, thankfully. Another sticker. There's a bunch of stickers in here. This is our third sticker. What's this? What's this? Oh, no. What's this? Looks like some sort of friends set, but excellent pieces right here. These large plates. That's all we really care about. The rest of the stuff, I don't really care. Oh, one by two tile. Take that. That piece have uh, I don't know that many jumper. I think some jumpers. Great trans clear parts. 
been washing a lot of brick though. I almost got caught up on the washing. Then I just gotta sort it after I wash it, which is this is not. If you thought washing brick was fun, man, sorting is just fun. Just kidding. TJ Ninjago, right here, a little Ninjago something, a little spinner thing. That was any figure part, any fig, glass piece, glass piece. Is that Avengers Tower sticker? It might be. Maybe we can find some silly, expensive Avengers figs in here. 2019 spinner from the first Legacy Wave. Dude, you are on point with your identification. I knew that. I was just testing you. Just kidding. Bunch of these 1x4 slopes. I just can't. I can't leave these behind. Have to take these. Our gray brick. Perfect. There's some nice slopes right here. Some rock work. We can take those. I have enough stairs. I don't need nice large plate right here. I'll take that. Heads, minifigure heads. Hey, Clark's Variety Channel. How you doing? How am I sorting my parts right now? I'm going through this bin, and I'm gonna take anything I want, put it in one bin right over there. Anything I don't want in this bin over here. Anything that's fake, I will take out. Completely, uh, and then the stuff that I don't want, I would just sell off. I'll resell it, get my money back. I would take take out all the minifigure parts too. And after we go through that, I'll wash what I want to keep, and then I'll sort it in my uh, sorting system back here. Which is not the best yet, but oh, look at this beef bus right here. A lot of good parts on here, folks. That's Technic brick. Plates. I'll come back for that. Oh, Wonder Woman Brickhead. Zombie Apocalypse Wonder Woman Brickhead right here. Got cut out. Duplo Brick. Help. Oh. Some sort of friends creation right here. Look at all these great plates. I'm gonna take all this. And the candle, the candle. Oh, there's a Two, three night job. Ah! Yeah, yeah, once the whole process and everything, yeah. If they go through this whole bin, probably will take me couple hours but like I said I'm off tomorrow I might not do this tomorrow all day but I want to get one started for my weekend just to get going on I have so many to get through thankfully it's a it's a blessing honestly to have all this bulk like my whole storage room I probably have at least 30 30 bins like this I'm not even kidding you to go through right now if not more and they're all about, I would say, at least 20, at least minimum 20 pounds. So that's what, 30 times 20, 600? Yeah, that's what an Avengers Tower. So hopefully there's some Avengers figs in here, because those are shooting up right now. Yeah, these days really are flying by, man. It's been... It's already... And I, 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 I have tomorrow off, but thankfully, it's just some kind of friends... Zip line. I'm taking that. Taking that. Okay. But yeah, they, the days are flying by. It's like March. We got the March 6 promo coming up soon. 
very odd for a March 6th, middle of the month promo like that, I guess. I don't know. Not even middle of the month, like first third of the month. I don't know what I'm gonna I was thinking maybe I would go get the crocodile train. I need the crocodile train still. I don't know. Spend a hundred bucks just to get the Amelia Earhart. Oh, glass. Perfect. I need this again for the baseball stadium. But yeah, spend a hundred bucks. I don't know. Corner garage. Maybe. Maybe a corner garage. I don't have that yet, but. Would rather wait for a double VIP. I don't know. Doc Samson, did it been come with any manuals? Any vague idea what's inside? No, Doc, this is just random. Sometimes they have instructions in there. A lot of these bins I get locally don't have instructions. They're just kind of parts from uh, all over. And they just throw them in. But sometimes they'll have a manual or two. Other than that, TJ usually helps me identify anything that's Ninjago. Friend stuff sticks out pretty well. Um, it's just really a lot of random stuff sometimes. Star Wars is in here, though, I can tell just by the parts you pull out, some of the figs you find. Beautiful, beautiful glass pieces. I just ordered some on Bricklink. Try to finish off the old stuff, too. BR, you need those panels. What panels? I do. Crocodile Trans is great set, only really bad part is the black construction. Yeah, I heard they're switching back, too. Someone someone tweeted that, or put on Instagram, that Lego is switching back from that black, that black, uh, backing. Yeah, I do need panels, though. I am taking all the panels, Shiny. The Friends Hot Air Balloon. Give me that. Give me that plate. Give me that tan plate. I don't want those jumpers. Honestly, you know what? You know what's really bad too. You know what's really bad? I need to sort. I need to sort my smaller parts better. I, I pass up a lot of smaller parts. Uh, just I don't have a spot for them in sorting yet. But we will see. Ooh, what's this chunk of thing? Oh, some sort of friends. Thing, I think. Oh, I see some leaves. We're gonna take those. You know what I'm saying? Take the leaves. Hand arches. Those. Oh, they're out there. You know, we'll take all that. We'll come back for what we don't want. Lavender, little fence pieces like that. I haven't seen that yet. Thanks, friends. Hard to tell colors of times on black milk. Yeah, it really is. Yeah, good. I'm glad, dude. That feels black. My only experience so far has been the police station, which I messed up a couple things. Like, that's why I thought, I was like, why is the bench so bad on the police station? I built it wrong. Um, <laughs> because I must have messed it up in the manual. A lot of tan. I need to get another bin already. Bins are full. Oh, that's how backlogged I am. <laughs> this says, uh, this is the Solomon R. Guggenheim Museum. So something like this. I think this is like, let's we'll say 60 bucks on Bricklink. I paid 60 bucks for this whole bin. Like, I, I still don't think I'm going to go through and try to find all parts to this, but you never know. We'll see. Little Lavender Friends boat. Dibs on the Guggenheim Museum? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if that's going to be a, ooh, a purple flame. I can change the fountain. In my park, from an orange thing with purple flame. On a penny, put that with our quarter. Now we're at 26 cents back on our investment, baby. 
Let me get another pin real quick. Let me go find another pin. I'm gonna take this pin. Throw that in there. Print for this stuff. There. Now we have a larger. You want? You want just the base, really? You want just this base? Fine. Put it off to the side for you. I tell it. Sure. Friends party plus. Blue base plate. Take that. The purple flame balloon in four sets. Three of them are Ninjago. Boom! Oh, here's the Adidas sticker. Cheap one of this Adidas sticker. I remember when I first got this pin. I a picture of it. This pin is almost a year old. I want that Adidas sticker. It's part of an OYO. This is an OYO baseball thing. So I found that fake OYO share theater. You guys are finding some figs though, right, TJ? Where's that, where's that golden Ninjago? Never seen this technique part before, right? Leo. Lego. Hey, architecture tiles. I have some other ones I can put together. We have a big Ben one. I think this is a creator house part. Honestly, I don't know. Yes. Another friend's rooftop pool. Party Palooza. I want that base plate. Last one was like this. Crater Poolside House, thank you for that. Ah! Hell yeah! Double A battery. Find it all today, baby. That light coral on the blue. See if I can get this focus. Dude, ah. No, camera just doesn't focus on All right, TJ, you're up again. Stickers on this door panel. Can you ID this? Anybody? It focuses. Let's see how manual focus. Oh, uh, I think we have manual focus. Try that on manual. Interesting. Interesting. The glass panel, perfect. Spotted a piece from the ultrasonic raider set. Could be in here, man. Could be in here. Is that my brick separator? No, I have one. Where's the figs at, man? Enough parts to counteract all the figs, or lack of the figs. The crater house, it looks like. Ooh, dark blue slope. I 
he's a bunch of bugs. They didn't even move. I was sick all that one. So hard not to take anything off. Oh, it's from a frozen set. Oh man. Oh that yeah, Mike, that is the uh that is gonna be the Ghostbusters HQ. And I, I confirmed it. I picked up the, the uh the bin and it is real. So we'll see how much of that is in there. Coral stairs. I'm gonna do anything. See, that's a, such a tough part to pass up some parts. You don't know if you can use them in the future or not. I can't, I can't hold on to everything. Maybe. On the space. Doors from a frozen set. Lame. Thank you, though, for identifying that. that hot air balloon. What do we want off here? These little... Actually, we'll take them out. Look at all that. That's the real shiny. Yeah, that's the real shiny. Oh, here we go. First Friends Fig. This is like a $40 fig right here. I'm just kidding. Friends fix them? I don't know if there's any expensive ones, but they sell really well for me, like just in group. You get a large lot of friends fix. Sell pretty quick and for a decent amount of money. You get about at least two bucks of friends fig. There's if I know one of them is like an expensive one, like it's a Disney one, that'll help that'll increase the value. But just like in general, I usually put my friends look things at like Two bucks, is that a print or a sticker? I think that's a sticker. Let's see if we can get the manual focus. Wait. Oh, it's focus. now it likes to focus once I do it manually. Like, it's hilarious. No, no, it's out of focus. Kind of, sort of. It's a pretty sick printed part right there. Not gonna lie, I'm kind of impressed with that. That one's a sticker. There's one. There's one that is a sticker on there. The shiny longers. <laughs> it is the shiny man. The Elsa or Anna, one of those two. Friends Lighthouse, I guess. Fake. You can tell us by the way the red is not really a vibrant red, or it's too vibrant. I don't know what I'm talking about. I just know it's fake. good parts on here. Or rock work parts. Instead of making you guys watch me break down all the parts, I'll just do it later. Take out what I want. And I'll break it down. It sucks. I'm seeing a lot of parts I ordered on Brickling for the past few months. Like, dude, if I just went through a lot of the open. Ski, lift chair. Oh, look at all these panels. You see, we're talking about shiny these panels. Ooh, geez. You watch the sands on Twitch. Then I was over off the Zoom before wandering over here. Oh, some more baseball stadium building. Yeah, I gotta get some more parts ready. I get some more parts ready, man. That's like the one. That's the coolest thing I like about where we're at, and just YouTube now with Lego. There's so much content out there. You can always. Someone's always live. You know, there's usually 
I mean, everybody that is out there, you can catch some sort of live whatever. So if someone's building, if there's someone just chatting with a bunch of people or by themselves, or great, great. A lot of options for people to hang out and chat and meet new people. My pick a brick had those glass panels. They had them for like a week, and I went there again to get more. They didn't have any. I was low key, a little upset. Cause that, those were great. They were like eighty cents a piece. With the uh, you know between what they put in the cup and everything, which on Bricklink you know they're pretty uh not super pricey on Bricklink, but they're definitely not cheap. Burp. Is it a lurp? It's a burp. I don't know. Burp. Now, where's all the big bed? seen that side of the before. In any color, I should think. What's up, Rhonda? How you doing tonight? Oh, here we go. Finally, some action. Who's this guy? Who's this fake helmet? Wrong way. I keep going the wrong way. Star Wars. I don't know which one. One of them. I need this for the other stuff. Yeah, there's a small build of red and gold parts on your top. It looks like part of the two of four ninja charter. Okay, red and gold top. I think that's what you're talking about right here. You're talking about this? Like a wheel arch in there. Who are we talking about? We'll throw it off to the side though. Just on the oh, look at the size of this rock. Holy cow. Marie, those are some rocks. That's Commander Gree. Commander Gree money. That's all I care about. Holy hell, what the hell is this thing? Bro, what is this? Is this Bionicle? Is this what everybody's going crazy about? This is like some... It has like... Dude, what? What the hell is this? What theme is this? Oh, it's Hero Factory. You know how I know that? Because there's a Hero Factory dude in there. Damn it. I thought it was something cool. It's Hero Factory. Yeah, Doc's Hero Factory. I guess it's cool. It's different. I've never seen it before. Like, there's a Hero Factory big in there. I wonder what set this is. I wonder if it's worth anything. Like, obviously it's worth something, but I don't know if it's like worth a Hero Factory dude that popped out of it. The 2014 X19 Chargers, uh, price set. Okay, okay. Ninja Charger. I gotta, I gotta look this up real quick. Hero Factory. Let me, let me go on Bricklink real quick here. Let's see. Bricklink. What set is that? I think it's a mess. Yeah, it's in parts. It's all over the place. But it's looking kind of. I thought I was like, oh! And it broke off the head, but whatever. That's right, right, Hero Factory. It's not worth much just getting stripped of parts because it has some good dark bluish gray on it. 
Let's see. I search Hero Factory in Bricklinks. So you know what that means. Nothing's, nothing's going to pop up. Set. Let's see. Oh god, their sets suck. I can't even tell by their set images. I was there only 23 Hero Factory sets. That can't be right. Oh, because they're all super packs. Oh. That's why. That's why. I'm trying to figure out what the name of this thing is right here. It's Hero Factory something. I don't know if it's some sort of Leviathan. It looks like a Leviathan. Okay, let's see. Let's see. No, no, no. I'm in Bricklink now. Page 2, Bricklink. Uh, it's not on page two. And it's not on page three. WT. I right, see if we can pull a part number off something here. Here we go. What's that? 41881. Let's see. 41881. The old fashioned look up the part. Let's see, that is what, a dark red windscreen. Color info, trans red. One set. Oh, it's Bionicle. It's not Hero Factory, it's Bionicle. Set 8927. Toa Terrain Crawler. It was Bionicle from 2007. Let's see the price guide on this sucker. $91. Holy hell. I bet you I can get 20 bucks just for it as parts. So we're going to put that to the side in its own parts bin. I bet you I can get money for this just with parts. Bionicle stuff. Any more Bionicle figs popped out of it? Yeah, that guy's good. 2007. Had a bunch of little spears and stuff in it. Interesting. Bionicle. Oyo fig with a Lego head on it. Rock. I don't even know what else looks like it goes in that set. I don't even know. Beefy tree build pick that. I saw a Hero Factory too, Doc. I know, I always forget Bionicle had actual little, like, figs. do some more Star Wars though. The 
the Batman Bane Tumblr hood or roof feet, whatever it is right there. It's like some sort of Ninjago stuff right here. This goes here. Probably part of that spinner. Spinner. All right, TJ, thanks for hanging out, man. Good luck with your homework. Much appreciated. More friends. We can find some Ninjago figs soon. Oh, here's a bunch of these. These are for the... I'm gonna keep these one. These are for the Solomon House because I'm actually selling a smaller Solomon House. I need six of these panels. I didn't have them, but now I do. So let me take that one down. Let me take that one down, actually. Yeah. That is a good find. Dryer is done. The battery. I don't know who that is. Big torque. Sold something like this, too. Yeah. Wonder who this is. I have no idea. It's a friend's fig, some sort. Anybody can ID that. Much appreciated. What's up, cheap ass? Yeah, I'm testing it out with the, uh, the noise suppression. I want to see if the microphone. Negate the noise from here. I think it does. It's on the Bionicle set, cheap ass. This Bionicle Toa thingamabob. Hundred bucks on Bricklink just for that set if it's complete. Who knows if it is? Okay, I can tell you it's not actually with confidence. Old big green brick separator. Yeah, we'll see what it goes for. I don't know if I'll be able to get maybe maybe twenty bucks for it with parts. Who knows? Another one of these lavender fence pieces right here. Mr. Freeze? Is that who this is right here? Mr. Freeze? Hey guys, this was the bin from years ago, or not even a year ago, a year ago when you wanted this Adidas sticker. And I have the Adidas sticker. 
I remember, Aaron. I remember. I don't forget you. Do you feel like you got your money back? Good profit from the bo- Oh, absolutely. Yeah, this has been... Even though I didn't find that many figs yet, the amount of parts I got to keep for myself is uh, going to be worth it alone. The bulk, I'll get. I'll easily get my money back and just sell them the bulk. Yeah, I, I usually do pretty well with these bulk bins. I don't think I've lost money on a bulk bin yet, to be honest with you. It might have broken even by a dollar or two, but I don't think... And that's by breaking even by a dollar or two. I mean, I've kept probably like 50 bucks worth of figs for myself. So yeah, I don't think I've uh, actually lost money on any bullpen yet. And I've been doing this since 2013-ish. 2014? 2013, actually. Summer of 2013. I got back into it when I got out of college. Solomon's House parts. Creator Poly Bag, what's this? 30499. Brand new. Here's a Garma Armadon. I don't know what version of Garmadon this is. Which Garmadon this is. But here's a Garmadon. I, I will look this one up real quick because now I'm curious. Let's see. Garmadon. Bricklink. Garma Don. I know there's a couple versions of him that are worth some money. So let's see if this is one of them. While that loads up, for some reason my computer is super slow. Powering through here. Sixty-six minifigures, holy hell. That was what, Legacy? Yeah, it's this one. Nope, not not a money Garbadon, but still. Four dollar and ninety-five cent Garbadon. Two shell casing. I don't know why that's in there, but it is.
little friend's turntable booth for that party bus. Solid amount of parts right here, whatever this is. Got down there. One of these cool little beach fun mirrors, which I will probably just take down the glass and take a uh, sticker off it. What's up, randoms? Rhonda, how was your day? My day was good. My day was good. My day was good, Rhonda. I'm glad your day was good. Tomorrow's going to be another good day. Thank you for asking. Much Technic Park and Beers. Yeah, I'll take that. Put the whole bin in raw right your pile. You buying bulk? I can get you some bulk. How many were a bulk kind of guy? I took a bit bulk, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna go crazy tomorrow on my day off. Gonna be trying to reorganize, not reorganize the basement, but trying to organize some of the clutter that's down here. It's pretty bad. I got a video dropping tomorrow on the park, but other than that, I'm trying to organize and clean while washing parts and sorting parts. Did I find any instructions? Nope, not yet. I don't think you might, probably none in this bin, Rhonda. Star Wars minifigures. We're finding some friends. Yeah, shipping costs is a pain. Dude, and even like USPS just raised their prices on like their first class packaging again. I'm like, why? It's still. I shipped a package to somewhere, Montana maybe, and it hasn't gotten there yet. I shipped like over a week ago. I'm getting a little ticked off. Ridiculous. Like, even your package I sent to you the last week. Priority mail it took like five days to get to you. And it's it's unacceptable. And they can't. How do they justify increasing their prices? Well, yeah, if anybody works at a post office, I'm not mad at you. I'm mad at pricing. Going to thrifts tomorrow. That's a good question. Thank you for asking me. That's a great question. Uh, maybe. Maybe. I would like to sort through a lot of this stuff. Is this part of that Bionicle set? Where'd that thing go? And then, uh... Yes, it is. I'll do an auction on that, I think. Rhonda, you got 12 subscribers? Nice, right on. Seventy-five pounds flat rate box. Don't know if they have one big enough for the full tote though. Yeah. Brandon, probably UPS would be our best bet. I can probably get you a good deal. Tough though. It's probably be, uh, probably still be expensive for UPS. It's just a pain, dude. I get it. Stuff is expensive to ship. Costs money. But like when I first started selling on eBay a while ago, it was like it was like a dollar eighty-five. I think I complained about this last stream I was on. It was like a dollar eighty-five to ship a minifigure. Now it's like 
over three bucks for first class. Unreal. You know? Unreal. Let's see. I think it's in the camera. Can I aim it down more? Zoom it out in. What do you want to do? Take it out. Wow, oh, these nano blocks are a pain in the butt right here. Because they show up and these little parts are still a pain. Part of the airplane. Cargo. Good dark blue on that. Like that. The price was right on the bulk ship, wouldn't be too bad. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Depends. I, I, I'm sure like if you if you get just under 20 pounds, it's a, a whole different threshold of pricing than over 20 pounds. This bin is a lot of parts, which I'm not complaining about, but I expected better figs out of this bin. I'm not lying to you. Still could be some stuff. Maybe. It's a deep bin. You've got turns up or anything. Ooh, Star Wars big body right there. What is this? Jurassic World. Jurassic World. We want all that dark blue spray though. Another 22 shell casing. We're popping off 22s in their bulk bins. We're getting Ninjago vibes from the music. Yeah, we got some Ninjago in here. Jago in here, some friends. There was the there were Star Wars on top. I don't know what happened to all the Star Wars pigs. Here's a Lloyd. Got a Lloyd right here. Look at that crisp focus when I do manual focus. Bick and Bricks told Rhonda that you can be in one of the Holland and Ballin episodes. Hey, alright. Fix the one that's in charge of all that. My brick separator? That was my brick separator. Here you go, cheap ass. Here's a here's a Pikachu. What's this worth right now? Eight eight thousand dollars? Pokemon? Pikachu? Might be worth some money right there, huh? Is the noise filter blocking out a lot of the uh, a lot of the brick? I bet you I bet you it is, right? I tested it briefly, and when I'm not talking, I'm sure it blocks out a lot of it, which is amazing. Yeah. Two cents. How about five cents?
I've been, I've been watching a lot of, of uh, Pawn Stars on YouTube. They, had, they I didn't know they had a YouTube channel. They had a bunch of highlights and clips on there. I used to watch that show daily, man. That was like, that's what got me motivated to sell stuff on eBay with that show. Can we block out you talking? Oh, yeah, I can mute myself. Ha. Huh. Wise guy. Meanie pants. Yeah, I was I was curious to see how the noise the noise uh the presser works on that. No, I said pawn stars, alright? Pawn stars. That's why I specifically said pawn. Because you're a dirty mind. Pawn stars is so I went to that place in Las Vegas. And it just felt like a dirty shop. I was like, Ugh, what's the big allure about this place? I guess it was kind of cool, but I was just like, eh, just another musty smelling shop. So what's, what's more fake, that show or Storage Wars? That's a real tough one right there. Nice big train or semi, whatever this is right here. Storage Wars is more fake, you think? Oh! Oh! Alright, alright folks. We got an unopened BMF Lego Movie Series 2 right here. Let's zoom in just a little bit. Unopened CMF Lego Series 2. It doesn't feel like there's a whole thing in there though. Like, I feel like it doesn't have any accessories. Last time he was in Vegas, he went by that place and a crap ton of people out in front, went around everyone and made about three steps and security said, if you don't leave, I'm going to shoot. What? Jeez. What were you wearing? I hate Rick Harrison t-shirts. Oh, they were filming an episode. Oh, all right. It's... it's, oh, it's Hey, come shoot me. Go ahead. It has a one by three. Oh, you know, it's the wild style. It's the wild style. I can feel the, uh, the neck piece right there. Do I open it? Should I open it? Should I open it? I don't know. I, I know it's the wild style. What do I do? Can I open it? I don't know. One Lego character. I already know it's the wild style. All right, she has binoculars. Uh, no, oh, she best has no random says do. I need a third vote. Someone, hey, I got one vote for open it and one vote for no. I know we have 5,000 people watching right now. So if I can get someone else out there, open it or don't open it. It's not Mr. Gold. Yeah, that's true. That is true. That is true. You know, I'm I'm gonna leave it. I'm gonna leave it. I'm just gonna open my hands. If I go open my hands, it's over with. Noah Tukes is open. All right, thank you. Much appreciated. Oh, we opened our hands too. And it was the wild dial. It's actually a really cool 
a really cool headpiece right there. Let me put on my manual focus real quick. It's actually a really cool headpiece, in my opinion. What's up, Lego Zoner? How you doing there, man? Overshot my focus. There we go. Well, never mind. Yeah, I've opened that bad boy. I, I like that headpiece. I'll take that for my parts collection. How you doing tonight, Zoner? Hope you're doing well. Just found the unopened, the open series, Lego like Movie Series 2 minifigure, which turned out to be the Apocalypse Wild Style. Which, randoms, you need that actually for your Apocalypse thing, don't you? You need it. You need it. Well, I'm prickling and buy all those. Everybody's doing well. I'm pretty sure I'm doing well. I can't talk for everybody, but no one's told me they're not doing well. How are you doing? Zoner. Expanded your train tracks. Nice. Nice. Speaking of train track, that FX track uh, random. I saw they're coming out with the four. The four length track, which I'm pretty stoked for. Let me zoom back out. Right now I have those flex tracks and then I gotta I gotta copper tape those. So depending on the pricing, I might just buy those. Yeah, four. It's four. It's the same as the uh same length as the flex track, but it's nine volt. And it's it's a four straight. It's not like a flex track wobble flex. I saw it on their coming soon section. Yeah, yeah, it is a good thing. It is a good thing. I was like looking at the flex track sections I had yesterday. That's why I don't have a, a full nine volt loop right now. If I have two flex tracks worked in, I gotta put copper tape on them. That's a pain. That copper tape's kind of a pain, man. I tell you. Holding up for the motors, baby. Yeah, motors. I was like looking at, uh, I was drawing up some table expansions, how I can already expand the Lego City. And it's like, I was going to go to Home Depot tomorrow and look at some stuff. I looked online quickly, like, their stuff is still expensive, man. I was, I was looking at MDF boards. It was like 37 bucks a panel now. I was just going to get four, like, industrial shelves. Like the, you know, black metal shell. Put them on top of that like I had in my old setup. But, uh, I don't know. Still on a bolt in this thing. Zoom in a little bit. Let's see the bolt better. We found some wire to replace it potentially. Night. Yeah, the MDF stuff ain't cheap, but I feel like that's definitely uh it's definitely the strongest, I would say, right? You got your bulk from Goodwill and Proxvid. Where do you I get mine? I get mine from a local store. Not not Goodwill. I've gotten one bulk bin from Goodwill. 
uh, when the pandemic first started and my place closed just to see uh, how it would do and I, I made some money on it I had to sell a lot of the figs but I made money. But Goodwill is hard to get stuff from for cheap you found four foot uh, four six foot folding tables and habitat for me at ten bucks a piece. Oh nice. That's four Times ten that's forty Quick bucks. Looks like the price of one Are they all the same height are they are they, they level are they unlevel? How bad are they? Or how good are they? Okay. Assume they're bad, What's the local store exactly? Because there's not one store that I know of that does it here. Oh, it's just a local uh, secondhand store. My uh, the Goodwills around here don't sell them. They do them all online. I, I think. Almost positive all the Goodwills around here do them online. All the same, they those event tables, salad fold legs, usually school shirts. Ah, uh, yeah, I know, I know what you're talking about. I was gonna maybe take a ride down to Icia on Saturday and get one of those tables just to test them out. The Aldis tables, if I can organize my section over there, over there. So I can start filming some reviews. I do. Oh, hell yeah! Polar bear! Hell yeah! You go to BR's neighborhood and shop his thrifts. Cheap ass, you're more than welcome to come over here and shop my thrifts that never have any Lego. Ever. Goodwill never has anything. Whoa, an alien queen. Cheap ass, what's she going for nowadays? Alien queen. Wow. Alien queen, folks. Look at this. Fine. I don't, I don't really care for too many alien figs. This one is... Queen. I don't think I've actually ever, ever found one of these yet. In the bulk thing. I've always found parts to one, but never an actual complete one. I think most Goodwills don't sell bulk, from what I understand. They sell it, send it all to Seattle to be sold online. Um, I mean, Seattle Goodwill online definitely is the, the powerhouse, but there's other ones in California. There's one in Maine, I think. There might be, I think there's generally just one of New England. There's one in Maryland. Um, but I know Seattle is definitely the big powerhouse one online. There's a couple other ones. If you look on, on the, their website, you know, Goodwill's website, they have the, uh, they'll tell you where it's from. Some of them are from actual other ones besides just Seattle. But yeah, Seattle Goodwill. It used to be a secret. Or not a secret. It used to be not as known. Then they got popular. And they have fake, they have fake bidders on there. They bid their prices up. Here's a Hana or Elsa, whatever the hell it is. Oh, your Goodwills there have a lot of bulk. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's, got, it's definitely a regional thing. It definitely is a regional thing. Parts of that plane. Acorn? $13 alien fig? Hey, let's go. 
I'm talking about. But the uh, the Goodwills, their their online prices get stupid, dude. You get danger if you can overpay for something. At the club, we saw we were watching one auction. It was the the night bus, which is available at like Amazon for like forty bucks. And it was up to like sixty bucks on that website. I was like, what? It makes no sense. That's how you know that they bid their own stuff up. It's ridiculous. Trying to find some local Lego sellers. Keep checking like local sites. I get some good stuff every now and then from local like uh, Facebook Marketplace, Craigslist, OfferUp. You know what I haven't had good luck with? It's actually like tag sales, garage sales, whatever you call them in your area, yard sales. I haven't had any luck with that around here for um, Lego. Like on like town wide tag sale days and stuff. No one ever has Lego. If they do, I don't get on before I get to it, which is fine. But I know some people find some crazy stuff that way. Shill bitters, that's right, man. Saw a mint Guerrero skateboard go for 17,000. Oh my god. What? Huh? Huh? Yeah, I mean, if you're going to do Craigslist and stuff, just be careful. I mean, I haven't come across anything bad yet or try to get scammed yet. I don't think I don't think Lego will be a hot, hot scam area, but just always be careful. I like to meet in public places during the daytime. Speed through this a little bit. Take some bulk up. Seeing uh, that eight by eight lavender dish, I found a clear one. I need to look up what set it goes to. Nice, clear eight by eight dish. Good lavender one. I'm gonna throw it in there. Where's all the figs? Gotten a good response to my bride wanted at Craig's. <laughs> Jeez. <clears throat> I picked up a minute ago. Could be gone, gone forever. Things cheap ass says. There's a net. Fake Lego brick in there too. Forty-two hockey player. Never. Uh, okay.
Try to get some more parts ready for Sunday. Have a good build on Sunday morning. Almost ran out of parts. Which is crazy because I have all these parts. I just gotta gotta get them built, you know. Gotta get them sorted and built. Hair piece. What time is it? Nine o'clock. Probably go for another half hour. Get two hours exactly on this. Flame. Wait, we got the purple flame early. I'm gonna know. Requiring flame. Move some more Lego today. Got to unpack so I can reuse the box. Yeah, man. Got to. I got to figure out some stuff here. I got another bullpen waiting for me. I got to go pick up tomorrow. My contact got me. That's right, cheap ass. I got contacts too. Not for my eyes. I got good vision. Sold the bulk bin last night locally, that was good. Clear out some space. Mm -hmm. Man, dude, with the amount of Star Wars shit. I thought there'd be way more Star Wars things. By the amount, I mean one. There's one Star Wars ship on top. I've barely found anything Star Wars. Your eyes are jacked. That's right. My eyes are jacked, baby. 2020 vision still. Somewhat. I think. I went to the eye doctor for the first time in my life last year. Before COVID. And they were like, the vision's good. Got some sort of something that's starting to develop. Like, not you don't need glasses. I was like, okay, cool. Later, doctor. Hi, doctor, man. Learn from the master. That's right. It was actually my contact that got me into the bullpen. Yeah, hundred percent honest with you. Like, I was out of. I was sitting at home one day, and my contact said to me, Hey, you should try this place. They have uh, Lego bins there. I was like, okay. okay. First bin I got, I, I'm not kidding you, was the it was Star Wars, the AT. The one that has the dropship attached to it, that like the dropship, the whatever it was. And since then, it's been just... Go from there. We got an Emerald Knight out of the bulk bin that I sold off because I was new to bulk binning and I didn't know. I wasn't really back into collecting them. More in it for the money. But we actually found another Emerald Knight in the bulk bin, so that was also a good day that I kept that one. Actually, I sold the engine for that Emerald Knight. And I, randoms, you might actually have that engine. Because I sold that engine to the person you bought your train collection from. So you might actually have an engine that came from me.
Potentially. Oh yeah! Yeah, you might actually have an Emerald Knight engine that was sourced from a bin just like this. Here's the wings for that plane even finding. I just thought of that. I just remember that. Did it have stickers? Uh, I believe it did. I believe it did. Have some of the cheap acid stuff as well, yeah. You got a little third party brickage going on there. Ladies, is that another quarter? Another quarter. It's 56 cents or 55, 51 cents. Found money. Oh, the one. Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh. Uh. Oh, you got two from him. If you got two from him. You definitely got one, man. I'm, I'm saying 80% one of those is mine. From your crew. Yeah, funny how it all comes around. It's kind of funny. Conveyor belt. Destroyed. I don't even want to zoom in on it. How bad it is. Starting to give out. I'm too old for this standing. Emmett, bad cop, and Boba alarm clocks. Forgot you had them. I don't think I have any alarm clocks. The Boba Fett one's probably worth some ka-ching though, right? Some money? Yash. Will Imagine X Batman thing. We did the uh, flowers in the park today after work, and I built a new tree. 
I gotta get better at building trees or more experience building trees. This one came out. It's a different type, I guess, I was going for. Practice. Gotta keep practicing. There's a ton of parts that we're getting for building, so that's good. It's a little bin. It's probably at least, I'd say at least five or ten, five, five, between five and ten pounds. Between five and ten pounds or even. Where we're gonna go through some of that I didn't break down fully, but. It's been kind, it's been kind to us, that's what you know. Not a home run, but enough to still make our money back. at 9 15 in three minutes shut this sucker down i'm glad the noise the noise suppression worked for the bulk thing good to know Lego I'm trying to look inside of it. I think it's something to do with Duplo. Focus in on it for me, real quick. It's kind of cool, actually. I'm almost positive it's Lego. It's definitely Duplo, but I'm looking on the inside of it. I think it says Lego in there. I can't. 100% see it. Let me get my magnifying glass. Let's see. No, I'll do it later. I think it's. I think it says Lego though. I think it does say Lego on it. So that's good. I can use that in a build or something at some point. Kind of cool. Little pirate scene. Little pirates. 
915. I'm gonna shut this thing down. Oh, I had to sit down for a second. My leg was starting to have a bum knee. But yeah, we got some decent stuff, some decent figs. Nothing super crazy. Probably the polar bear is the coolest thing in there right now. Got a good amount to still go through. We got this whole bin right here that I gotta wash, sort, and organize. But, and some base plates. Minifig Collector, what's going on, man? I'm about to sign off for the night here. How you doing, Minifig Collector? Got some decent minifigs in here. I'm gonna collect them. We'll see how it's going, but... Cheap-ass randoms, Minifig Collector. I'm gonna pop out. Thanks for hanging out, man. Much appreciated. Lego Zoner, good talking with you. Who else was in here? Doc Sampson was in here. No Took was the deciding factor on opening up that wild style. So thank you for that. M Productions, Rhonda Fritz, Doc Sampson, Titanium J52, Mike McDonahue, Gary Mullane, Cowie's Creations. I think that's everybody. All right, I'll catch you guys on the... Tomorrow I have a video dropping on the park update, so be sure to check that out. And if not before Sunday, Sunday the latest. I'll probably be back before then, to be honest with you. I'm about to stream the rest of this. I might just do this while watching some, uh, some something. You know what I'm saying? Later. Bye, everybody. Thank you, as always.